Graham, thank you for doing this. It's oh, really, really, really important for it's us. It's my honor. Thank you very much. You'll hate it afterwards. I mean, you won't want to talk to me after a few hours. <laughs> I know where you live, buddy. <laughs> um, these are conversations between us. We can go wherever we want. It's really to talk through the whole experience of being an actor and the art of being an actor Ooh, wow. from the insides because I really, it's really important for all those young men and women, wherever they are in Fort St. George or Peterborough, you know, they're doing a high school show and they want to kind of go on and say, okay, I want to, oh yeah, Graham Greene played Shylock. I want to hear about that, you know, because he does. So it's to put that out <laughs> there. That's really what it's Yeah. Good. Well, it's, it's, uh, to be an actor is an amazing, amazing escape from reality from time to time if you want to do that. But if it's too hard, do something else, which I meant to say, if you don't have the heart to be an actor, Try something else, because not everybody can be an actor. Not everybody is an actor. Not everybody wants to be an actor. But if you choose that path to go down, it's um, a couple of things you must have is a hard head and thick skin. If you don't like rejection, don't be an actor. If you don't like disappointment, don't be an actor. If you like working long hours and misery and uh, doing the same thing repetitive over and over and over, don't be an actor, unless you want to work in a factory and put something together, the same thing every day for eight hours. It's a, a difficult path to follow. When you say you've got to have a heart to be an actor, you mean it's got to be an emotional reason, or? Uh, the heart, by the heart I mean is uh, the, the, uh, the, 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 the enough to put yourself out in front of an audience every night to uh, take your insides and show them to them your, what's up here and what's in here and put it out on the stage and make them believe that you're that character. That's putting your heart out there, putting your heart into it is, is probably the, the hardest thing before you go on stage is to stare in the mirror and go, you're not you anymore, you're so-and-so, you're this character for the next couple hours, three hours or whatever. You have to be that guy, that person, that girl. And it's difficult for a lot of people nowadays to uh, get into it. It's, it's, uh, the, the industry is, theater, I don't know, I haven't worked in theater since 2007 at Stratford, but the film industry is extremely difficult to get into. You don't know what you're stepping into. Your agent will call, I got this project for you. Yeah, okay, I can get you in it. Yeah, that's nice. Okay, you'll be working from this to this. Uh, that's that's great. Um, can I ask a question? Yeah, what is it? What, it? what 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 project is this? What the hell is it? What are you talking about? Oh, we can't get a script because it's it's hush hush. It's very secret. I said, how am I going to say yes to something I don't know what it's about? And uh, they said, well, we'll we'll try to get you this and that and a few other dribbles and drabbles of information about what the project is. And they'll phone you up or you phone them and bug them and they say, oh, we got a title for it. I said, good. The one-legged what? That's the title. <laughs> what do I do? Well, we're working on that. Yeah, I don't know. And so you're in constant flux in, in, in the unknown, standing in the dark with no clothes on, waiting, to, uh, waiting for either the sun to shine or the wind or the rain or the snow. You don't know which way it's going to happen.